take the week off with something really basic, and we're talking about Word here, and this is actually something that comes up an awful lot with new employees or people new to Word, and it's one of those things that kind of drives them crazy. And what I'm talking about is line spacing versus paragraph spacing. So what is paragraph spacing? What is line spacing? Well, they're two very different things. So here I have a document, and essentially I have three paragraphs. Now, how you could determine how many paragraphs you have would be to go to the Home tab and click the Paragraph Marker button, the Show Hide button. So if I click that, you'll see it shows these paragraph markers there, there, and there. So I have three paragraphs. Basically what it means is I've typed this in, Word Wrap has wrapped to the next line, and then I pressed Enter. Now, a couple things that can come up in your own documents is if people use uh, double enters to space paragraphs. This can actually cause problems related to paragraph spacing, so I would suggest leaving those out when we're talking about document text. So the first thing let's talk about is how to adjust your paragraph spacing. Well, to do this, I'm going to select all my paragraphs because I'd like to adjust all of them. And let's just say, uh, for now, that I'd like to remove the spacing that is automatically being put between uh, my paragraphs. There's several ways to do that. So first way is on the Home tab, into the Paragraph section, you have a button that says Line and Paragraph Spacing. I think this is partially where some of the confusion comes into play. Lines are different than paragraphs. We'll talk about that a little bit more later on. So if I click this button, the first option you have are all related to line spacing. You can actually see this little dividing line here. That's separating line spacing from paragraph spacing. So here, I could choose to remove the space after each paragraph. If I do that, you'll see it removes that space. There's no longer a space between my paragraphs. I'm going to remove the marker so it's not as confusing to look at. So you see there's no space there. The other way to do this is we could actually go to the Page Layout tab. And on the Page Layout tab, you have a paragraph section. And you have Before, which is spacing that would be added before each paragraph. And then you have After, which is an amount of space to go after each paragraph. Where these become really handy is when you're dealing with things like titles, um, chapter headings, these types of things. They're their own paragraphs, and so the before and after spacing is important there to differentiate. In any case, if I wanted to add some in, I can simply increase the after spacing. You can see in my document it's already added it in. 12 points would be standard one line of text between each paragraph. So that's paragraph spacing. Now let's talk about line spacing. And line spacing is the amount of space between each line within a paragraph. Nothing to do with actually spacing out lines, let's say, from paragraph to paragraph. So line spacing is just for spacing lines within a paragraph. And to do that, we could go to the Home tab. And on the Home tab, we could use that same button, the line and paragraph spacing. And I want you to see this. As I change these options, you can see that it's the lines in my paragraph that's changing, not the paragraph spacing. So as you can see, as I increase this, the line spacing is going to increase according to you know whatever your font size is and things like that. So this is two times larger. You'll notice it has adjusted the paragraph spacing a little bit when I go to these. Uh, so if I wanted to do, let's say, one and a half space, I choose 1.5. There it goes. It applies it. You can see there's a lot more space between my lines. To remove it, you simply select. You can go back to 1, which is very tight, or 1.5. 1, 5, which is kind of a nice way to read through your text. So there you have it. That's some line spacing options as well as some paragraph spacing options.